In this video, I'll show you how to add transitions to your videos or media in the timeline in Camtasia. Welcome to this video. My name is David. If this is your first time watching my videos and you get value from the content that you watch, kindly consider liking this video and share it with your friends. Now, the reason why I'm doing this video is because you may run into this particular issue where you want to add a fade to just one clip and not the other. When you add a fade, to clips adjacent to each other or clips that are next to each other inside Camtasia or basically in most of all non-linear editing softwares, the fades or whatever type of transition you use affects both clips. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to add a transition and then I'll show you how to do it for both clips and then for just a single clip that you want to add the fade to. So to add the fade, you obviously have your, your media or your clips, your images, down on the timeline and then you'll need to come to the left tab here and if you cannot see transitions they might be somewhere under more uh, where you can see them if they're not visible here so I'll just click on transitions and once I click on transitions then we'll have all the different types of transitions available so uh, I'm doing this inside Camtasia 2020 but in Camtasia 2021 there are more uh, transitions that you can use let's assume we want to fade this clip through uh, black so we'll just drag this particular fade and then just drop it there and whenever you hold a fade uh, you'll see all the yellowing of the clips showing you that you can add those fades somewhere there so once I drop that you'll see that the fades appear here so if I just zoom in you'll notice that uh, the fade was applied to both clips if you hold an end of the fade then you can just pull it down to reduce the, du the duration of that particular fade. Now, if I click on that and then separate, uh, let's press on shift and pull to the side, then the fades uh, will appear differently on the different clips. So you can easily right click and delete so that you can delete that fade from that, but still have it here. Let's press on control Z uh, to undo uh, those particular changes. Uh, so just to make it known out there that whenever you add a transition to clips that are joined together, this is what happens. The fade or whatever type of transition you've added is added to both clips. But if you actually separate both clips, even by just putting, pulling one up uh, to a different track, you can easily just right click on that particular fade and delete it and then bring back your clip. So you'll just have the fade on one particular uh, end. So if I just play this, fades out into that. So uh, alternatively, instead of uh, doing that, uh, what you can do, uh, let's assume you have your clips. Let's just uh, bring this down. Uh, what you need to do before you add your fade or you add any transition whatsoever, make sure that the clips that you want to add to are separate. So if you want to add a fade here, all you need to do is just drag it there and it's added there. So instead of affecting both clips, you'll just have that on one particular clip, fades out into that. So if you do it when clips are next to each other, then you'll notice that it gets to both clips or both media on the timeline. So that is how you can add transitions to your videos or images in Camtasia. Thanks for watching. My name is David. Until next time, stay safe and never stop learning.